Yeah. Hi, everybody. Hello, ladies. How's everybody doing? Let's see. Candy, Beth, Jude. Jude. <laughs> Jude. I got to uh, see Kendall. Kendall, Marianne. Glennis. Me and Glennis. We're the first Rhonda. one. Rhonda. Yeah. From down under. I wasn't muted. <laughs> Paula. Oh. Hi, Paula. <laughs> Hi, Paula. <clears throat> All you need tonight, so, girls, is your imagination and some fun and some stuff. Laces, cardstock. I use a um, pizza box. So if you want to gather anything like that up, we're just going to do our own thing. Hi, Debbie. Hi, Jennifer. Debbie, I see your package is getting closer to you. It's slightly, slowly hi, moving. Irina. Well, hi, Miss Crafty Irina. I'm so happy you're back. Hi, Mia. Actually, I was watching some, some of your mm -hmm. older videos today. And Card Chick 50. Don't know if she's been in our lives yet. So I, hi Tracy. I'm hi, Melissa. Tracy. Okay, girls, we're gonna um, we're gonna jump right in just in case the weather, the lag. I know. Yeah. Things are slow, so we're gonna jump right in. And I'm gonna, I'll Maggie. You want to say what you're gonna be doing? Well, I got out some doilies, um, some appliques. I did some, um, what do you call it? Um, poinsettia. I used the Tim Holtz poinsettia dye. That's why I was trying to think of the word dyes. Um, and then I printed out a couple of images and stuff so I can use paper along with the fabric and the laces just thought i'd do a little a few different things okay and i'm going to do things with um cardboard and boxes this way we're cover we're trying to cover all your bases girls so if you have any kind of crafts that you're not using and you forgot that you needed to use so what i did is i just went on the internet and I just punched in um, clip art, uh, corset, a boot, a mitten, and a stocking. And I'll show you what we're going to do. I'll show you the completed ones. This one has, and this is just like you said, this is just repurposed cardboard. This one has one of those wax things that we did at another live with just pieces of lace, snippets of lace. And this one is more very um, shabby chic. And like Maggie had said, we were talking before the video, you could set these in the branches of your tree or if you wanted to. And I left this so you could see that was actually a potato chip box. Um, just a piece of whatever to hang. Or I, I think I will nestle them into the tree. So I got that yeah, I think one. And then this is the boots. And I just, I use some paper on this and then some, um, just, uh, applique from Crafty Me Shop. So you can, I mean, if you can cut out, I mean, the internet is so open to whatever shape you want. Then this is probably one of my favorites. This is a, um, little mitten and I used a piece of old quilt. I didn't have quite enough for the edge. So I just put another piece of lace there. So this is a good way to get rid of everything. And then I did one with a, I want to say dreams, etc. cetera, um, cut out with all different laces. Oh, that's And then great. this was, this was, um, oh, then, then I was starting to think junk journal. So I did this one with pieces of old, um, quilt and then I put a little pocket for a little journal well not a journal 
Oh, I glued it in. Big surprise. Oh, like a little pad of paper. So we can still make these work as little journals. So that's what we're going to work on. So I am going to set these aside. And like I said, what I did is I just um, cut it, traced it on a piece of cardboard. An old, I uh, recycled the box from a package I got. And then I just covered them with material. So I covered them ahead of time. I'll do one, but I didn't want to waste your time doing that. So what I did is, let's see, let's do, let's do this one. Because I got this old wedding dress. Hi, Becky. And Diane. Hi, Becky and Diane. And I, I got this old, really pretty <clears throat> wedding dress, and it's very, like, really brittle. So I'm just going to tear a piece off. See, no grunge tonight, girls. Maggie's going to no stay grunge. clean. <laughs> And you just kind of cover them. Don't worry. Again, don't worry about trying to cover the whole thing because it looks better. All right, there's a bowl, so I'm not going to make that bowl hit work. It looks better if it's, like, pieced together. So, and I'm just gluing it. I'm not thinking. Well, I'm going to – actually, I'm going to glue it down a little because I like to make some kind of a border right there. So many people are crafting with us. No, Beth, I just, I just rip and tear. But I was reading a book today with your beautiful quilt ripped in your quilt. I just love that. Takes me right back to the 1800s. I don't think it's that old, but it's just that feel. And let's see, let's do some, I do have some of this blue with pink. Hi, Lori. And hi, hi, Lori. Melissa. And Melissa. I thought I, I had turned my glue gun on and I forgot to plug it in. I turned okay. it on. I didn't plug it in. So I did I dig away. mine out. I haven't used it. And then we're going to probably go under this. And then if you wanted to, you can cover this in wax, play with your wax. And like I said, it does hit the Christmas lights. It has a nice glow. Oh, yes, I, I love it, Beth. That's one thing I will never tear apart. <laughs> What's that? that? Get torn. Beth, the uh, beautiful quilt I got from Beth. Oh, right. I said that's one I will never tear apart and use for anything. <laughs> and then just glue it. And you can, like I said, you can put, um, let's see, pictures on these. Like any shape. This is like pretty endless. Especially once you get on, you know, Google Images and oh my God. And you're just tracing them out, so. Did I miss anybody? Thank you, Irina. I am so happy you are back. I know, right? <laughs> she, she has so much to give in teaching her style. <clears throat> Melissa wants to know if that's paper or fabric, Lori. Um, what I'm you this is this is cardboard, this is lace, and this is fabric. The blue, I'm assuming she's talking. Kendall, you are right. She said, Hi, Miss Crypty Irene. I feel like we are in the presence of greatness. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, and then I'm just kind of layering. It's kind of like making a snippet just in the shape of a whatever you pick out. And then we got to do the toe of the stocking in the heel. I wonder if this is going to be too... So I don't want to be too gaudy, so I'm going to be too, too over the top. Not that we ever are. Oh, I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. All my laces here. Oh, this stuff. This is kind of like really coffee dyed. I just do like the round toe. Hi, Miss Renee. How are you? Hi, Renee. These are just cutouts. I just got off the um, traced mittens. And these are actually, these are candy canes I just bought today because I love cinnamon. And we're just going to um, decorate mittens and stockings. Maggie's doing decorations on doilies and appliques and some die cuts, right, Mags? You said yeah, I'm trying to make them small enough so if you wanted to, you know, put them on the tree as an ornament, you can. We'll oh, see. Cool. I don't think they're too big. How many people are going to be in the way of this big storm coming? I know Maggie is. I'm going to be on the fringe of it. Yeah, we don't know how much we're going to get, though. But they said it's supposed to be a really, you know, the worst storm in quite a few years, but we'll see. Patty cakes. I thought I was in my Patty. <laughs> Patty. Another Patty. Yep, another Patty. I'm just fussy cutting a uh, piece of a an app Esme applique crafty me shop oops got, forgot glass was under there we got the little now we need something here and I think we are gonna go blingy I think we need bling actually no we need a little more of the wedding dress to bring it down This was a beautiful dress at one time. We'll just, because I want the blue. I don't want the blue that in your face. I want it just. Nets out in California. She said they're getting rain. Oh. Okay, so then, then I got this piece. When I look at it, this piece is where I would be drawn. I'm just go for a minute, Lori. Say goodbye okay. to my dog. Yep. So I just need something like right here. And it might be. Um, could be a picture, could be you know what? They would be cute with hi, Cindy. Just a little like vintage stamped in it. I know they are calling for lots of snow, but maybe they'll be wrong. All right, I'm going to have to ink that up. Okay. That takes well. care of that. <laughs> I 
Okay, Scrap Graphic. Why do I keep forgetting her first name? Help me out, man. Oh, that's Colleen. Hi, Colleen. Colleen. Colleen with Kathy? Yes, with Kathy Bird. Another Colleen. They go on oh, okay. um, Tuesday mornings and Friday mornings on Colleen's channel, Tuesdays okay. with Kathy. I missed it um, I yesterday, that. though. Yep, I missed it. I forget it. what happened. I missed what did, what, something went on yesterday and I missed it. Okay. Hi, Cindy. Aw, oh, thanks. So I think I'm going to use Babritac to put these on anyway. Are you still using your glue gun? Did it warm up or you didn't bother with it? Well, it's warming up. I don't know if it's oh. ready yet, but I think I'm going to use Babritac for now. Okay, that's too much. So let's do a little. Oh, here we go. Just do a little. There we go. Hi, Holly and Ellie. Hi, Holly. Hi, Ellie. Oh, more Australians. <laughs> That's awesome. It's funny how it's the very next day over there. <clears throat> I know. I is tomorrow any better than today? <laughs> Actually, maybe that is of ready. Of course. Let's see. Oh, it is ready. Okay. Oh, let's see. We're going to just do a little... This seam binding because it matches that little bow from the wedding dress. And we're just going to do a little scrunching up. And then, Kendo, I want to see pictures of your mitten. Right? Or anybody else that's doing this stuff. Or anything else that you decided you came up with. Because I couldn't think. I was, you know what I didn't think of is Frosty's hat, the top hat. That would have been cute. But there's not, I couldn't put a lot of pink on it though. I think we're just gonna leave that. I'm just gonna set that aside. And that's Pretty much just kind of, I might hit it with wax later. I'm not sure. Put it in my fireplace. Send it away. Let's do, how I covered it, I just took the um, less busy side. And this is an old curtain. It's just white. And, and no measuring. I did have to cut it because I couldn't rip it. Hi, Patty. Patty is here. Our Patty. Hi, Patty. Our Patty. Yeah, our Patty. Okay, and then I'm just going to set this down. Eyeball it. Cut it. See, this is stress free, girls. Right. Stress free. And then cover this in glue. I might just leave that. That's enough glue, maybe. I'm gonna put these here. These are so cute. I really do like these. I 
just wanted to make quick and, you know, some quick and easy. Yes. Or if you need to, I mean, these are an, an ornament. I mean, you give ornaments as gifts if you need yep. a last minute gift. Some cookies and a little ornament. And just go around the side. The leg doesn't seem so bad tonight. I couldn't say anything. But. Oh, thanks, Annette. Let's see. <clears throat> oh, thanks, I'm Irina. I have two Annettes. I know, Maggie, sometimes I feel like the odd couple. <laughs> <laughs> but last, well, last week I had you pretty grungy. <laughs> oh, thanks, Holly. Aww. I'm trying to remember. I know there's a way of... Let's see if I can... Hi, Joanne. Hey, Joanne. So I just have to, do, have to cut where the... Nuts says no, Laverne and Shirley. Okay. <laughs> oh my God, I haven't seen that in ages. I know. That was fun. That was a good show. That was a good show. All right, so I got my other mittens. So this one I did a the quilt. I think I did it. No, oh, it goes that way. So this one, I will, let's see, I'll use a doily. I use a paper doily. Just so you guys can, uh, I don't want you to have to go out and buy anything. I mean, just look around your desk. and Especially these paper doilies, you can find these in the dollar store. Especially now with all the cookies. I just took yeah, one of them. At what? I was going to say, they have them at the grocery store, too. They're just more expensive yeah. than the Dollar Tree. See, I, hit, well, I did put one on here, but I covered it up. So that was a little senseless. But let's see. I'll try to leave some of that. Joanne says, that mitten is so cute, Lori. <laughs> Thank you. I know. I love the way the quilt came out on it. I think I'll just do my Christmas tree and mittens. I do love mittens. Oh, hi, Krista. This is Krista. Hi, Miss Krista. Australia. All right, I finished one ornament. And oh, my was, goodness, Meg. Well, quick and easy. Two doilies. <laughs> I cut up the applique to fit the little image that I had printed out and some binding to hang it. And I don't think it's too big for a. Oh, no. Um, a tree. Yeah. Pretty. So that one. Very pretty. And then let's see what else was I gonna do. Oh, I know I gotta do I have to do it ahead of time because it's I cut out a Tim Holtz um point setter. Where's that? I have that. Okay, I have some more of this little quilt. I got to use it because it's so cute. Oh, good. There they are. What do you know? I found something I was looking for. <laughs> that doesn't happen too often. <laughs> All right, so. You're just going to go around the top. Maybe like that. Oh, that's pretty. I'm just going to ink the edges of this, so this will take a minute. And I know poinsettias are red or white, but I wanted some pink in there. Oh, I love pink poinsettias. In the peachy pink? I don't yeah. know if it's man-made or what. Thank you, Linda. Hi, Linda. Hi, Linda. And Tina. And Tina. Joanne. Hey. 
cereal. You know, I, have play with, cereal I haven't played with for a while, which is between Do the dots. We're going to use some diamond dust. Mm. I haven't used that in a long time, probably since scrapbooking. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. Diamond dust. What is it? Well, you forget what, you know what I mean? You forget like what you have yep. and what you can use. I know I do. I'm just going to put this here. Oh, thank you, Cindy. Crystal loves making ornaments. Oh, the DVD discs. Yeah, that's something I've never tried using yet. Or the really the um, the pockets that you know they come in, but Ooh. doing something on the DVD discs. Speaking, of, I wonder CD. if these DVD boxes would hold these little mittens. Probably not. Hmm, they would be cute okay. if I made them a little smaller. That mitten would make a great journal cover, Cindy said. Yeah, it would. It is cute. All right. So let's see. How am I going to do this? I think I'll make use the same stuff I used on this one. Go like this. I'm going to make it three-dimensional. So... See. Hi, Miss Louise. Hi, Louise. That's it. This is another thing I haven't used in a long time. The pop, what do they call them? Oh, I don't know. I cut off the name of it. Pop dots, or oh God, yeah. I want it to be three D though. And then just stagger the leaves. Okay. And I still think I need my... Let's see. Okay, now the fun part. <laughs> Does anybody to... have a pile of paper next to them on the floor when they work? Just curious. Not saying that I, I do. Waste basket. I... Oh, you mean if you're going to keep them? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I just... Like kits. <laughs> I just kind of like fling them over to another part of the table. Oh, my table's full, so I go to the floor, and then when I try to get up my chair, I can't. Oh, dear. Okay. Let's see. Put some here. Um, what am I looking for? Oh, we could do one of them. We'll do one of these little tiny girls. With a little cheesecloth. Lori B, she has piles everywhere. My kind of girl. Hi, Elizabeth. I get a box to sit next to me. And hit it. Oh, that's a good yeah, I could try that. Hi, ribbon, ribbon, rose, and lace. Hello. Hi, Kathy. I have strips, tiny pieces on the floor of that. 
I have a little garbage bow on my desk. And as my grandson pointed out, well, Grandma, I see it's not working. <laughs> but Hi, Michelle. Hi, Kathy and Linda. Um, okay, so I don't know if you can see the Ooh. diamond dust on there. That's see the beautiful. I remember that now. Yep. Wait a minute. Let me get it on you. Hang on, Mags. Okay, there so I go. staggered all the these with the pop dots, and then I just added a little bit of glue here and there, and then just added the diamond dust. I remember that now. The diamond dust. Nice. Yeah, that is beautiful. And you use the dots in between those, the. Yeah, I put the pop dot. Uh, what do you call them? I was saying pop dots, but I don't know if that's what they're called. But yeah, see, you can see it's three dimensional. That Whoops. is so beautiful. Hi, Jenny. Just Hi, Jenny. No, we're just making pretty easy things, decorations. Maggie's making them out of doilies and die cuts, and she just made that beautiful um, poinsettia. That is gorgeous. Hmm. And I'm making things out of cardboard or um, tracing them out of cereal boxes or whatever. I'm making mittens, and these are little stockings. Hi, Jean and Elizabeth. I think Elizabeth was here. Yep. Hi, Elizabeth. Hi, Jean. So we have a variety for you girls to pick from or what you want to make. What's on your table? I think I'm going to just add this to this little doily here and then put a piece of seam binding in it and then and just. I think that's like gorgeous. Or I might put a piece of a dangle underneath it. Maybe that's what I'll do. I'll see. I want to get this on there. Lori sees diamond dust in her future. <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah, really. I, yeah. I even got, I do have that poinsettia die cut, the Spellbinders one. <clears throat> yeah, this is really, I mean, I've probably had this for like 12 years. It's a Tim Holtz. Yep. I used to do it with the scrapbooking. Wow. Back to the basement in the morning. Right. Yeah. That would be perfect as an ornament. That's what I'm doing, Michelle. Yep. I'm making it. Going to make it into an ornament. I'm going to see where I put the seam binding. Let's see if I have some pink. <clears throat> I do. <clears throat> hey, Megan, you gotta have pink. <laughs> right? Well, Jean was nice enough to send me a bunch of different colors. So oh, I do have some. Yeah, make beautiful tags. Yeah. What's on your table is the mess. <laughs> well, yeah, I've been there. Been there. Let's see. So I want to kind of make these go together, but different. Oh, thank you, Irina. Thank you, everyone. Oh. Sandy's going to go make dinner. Oh. <laughs> Have fun. Yep, that's a hit, Maggie. You're going to be making doily or uh, potatoes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, you know, and I, I was going to um, use Christmas paper to cut it out, and then I remembered... I don't have any Christmas paper, so oh, I just <laughs> use I just use one of the background papers from um, 
my porch prints. Uh huh. And I just I just cut it out with that this the pink and white snowflake background. Thank you. Tina, I saved all the political card stock type campaign flyers and then made made six journals. <laughs> oh, wow. Thank you, Irina. <laughs> it relaxes me. This is definitely therapy. Yeah, I have a feeling I'm going to need more of that. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's going to be a long winter. Right? It's going to yep. be a long winter, I think, too. All right, now I have to get the diamond dust off of my freezer paper my here. Poor, <laughs> my poor husband comes to my craft room and he sits on the bed. And I'm thinking, oh, you're not staying, are you? <laughs> I had flashbacks. <laughs> <laughs> no, you want to get a pizza? Yep. And then he left. <laughs> it did too. I was like, oh no. <laughs> it was terrible. <laughs> and I'm going to put, because I got roses on that one. Oh yeah, that's cute. Oh yeah, I want to see what I have for a... <clears throat> A dangle that I can use. A little dangle. Okay, and there's my other mittens. So you got the two mittens. They're kind of different, but go together. Oh, I should have flipped it the other way, but it's okay. So those are that. And let's see. Let's work on, all right, for you grungy girls, we'll do a grungy one. Because I started this. So this will be like, yeah, Melissa, he's better. Thank you, Joanne. We're just trying to get a variety for you girls. <laughs> My lock space is Deb. I think, yes, Deb. Yeah, we gotta have a grungy stocking. Oh, Ink it up. I have to say the mittens are cute and they did, they are so easy to print out. I mean, you could find any, there's so many on uh, clip art mittens you put in and you can do any shape you want. That was just the shape I did. And I like them because you can decorate them for the winter. They doesn't have to be, you know, after Christmas, you could just leave them up. I usually leave my snowmen, mittens, stuff like that. I'll leave out. Not that I have a whole lot of mittens, but I will now. Okay, so there's the grungy so far. And let's see, let's do a little. I had this Christmas grunge and more grunge Christmas. I know Becky, but I meant for Maggie so she doesn't get all dirty. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, that Becky's awful sharp. <laughs> she caught that. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> no, no grunge for me. <laughs> Not tonight, anyway. I've been trying to do more, though. I love it. I do love I've it. I've been trying. But then when you do something like these, you don't want to grunge them up. Because they're more the shabby. So that's why we have so many likes. You're welcome, Carol. 
It's a nice, easy project. Okay, let's see. We do have these little pom. Oh, that really grungy. I need some burlet for the toe. There, I had a, a little piece of a, um, a dangle trim there. I like that. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, my God, Maggie, that is absolutely gorgeous. Thank you. That is gorgeous. Yeah, I, I should add a little bit of glue here, though, just so it doesn't go anywhere. Oh, thanks, everyone. All right, so we got some little toll. Oh, wow, I've got two little... done. I can't believe that I've gotten two I was done. Just say, can you believe it? <laughs> <laughs> can you ornaments it is. <laughs> Well, actually, you no, I only actually did one. What's that? I actually only did the one. I had, oh, no, I did two. Okay. Yeah, I was going to say, there's no way you only did one. <laughs> no way. You need a patch for a grunge stocking. LOL. A patch. I can do the. the oh, like, yeah, you like had to darn. Darn the stocking. Oh. Hmm. All right. I have yeah, to turn on my phone. Something. It is cold. Get it all. That's a little better. <clears throat> all right, so a patch. Let's see what I got in an old quilt. I'll grunge it up anyway. Like maybe there. Let's see where did another color go. Maybe the owner of the stocking had a talented grandmother, so she double patched it. All right, let me sew that on. Is it doing anything there yet, Maggie, weather-wise? No, it, when, it's not supposed to do anything until um, Thursday. Oh. And then all as they said, what? because I think it's starting like around the Pennsylvania area tomorrow. Oh, and okay. then it will come down like the coast, but it won't hit us until, it's not supposed to hit us till sometime on Thursday. Uh -huh. So we'll see. <laughs> they're calling. They're calling it a nor'easter. Yeah, I see that. <clears throat> Biggest storm of the century. <laughs> right. Not sure about the century, but it's supposed to be pretty big. <laughs> Thank you. 
Oh yeah, you'll get it first, um, Michelle. Definitely. Okay, let's see what else do we have. We got um, just a covering of snow. We got last night and that. We're supposed to get anywhere from one inch to six inches, I think. We're, we're right on the line. We're in the valley. They call us the Mohawk Valley, so we're kind of dipped down. So sometimes it'll hang over us and we get a lot, and sometimes it just goes right over us. All right, we're going to yeah, run you up the they're, patch. They're not always right when they tell us, <clears throat> you know, the one we got last week, they said we could get like up to a foot. We got four inches. Yeah. But they we'll thought our even... area would get more. Yeah. Okay, how's that patch? Oh my God, that's so cute. All right, what else do I need? What else do I need? Um, suggestions. I'm going to take suggestions on this one. What else do I need? Oh, take care, Tina. I hope everything's okay at the doctor's office tomorrow. Bye-bye. Texture. Tennessee. You need a jingle bell and the toe. I can do that. I got little extra bells. Black darts in the toes. I got these little tiny bells. It's gonna have. Oh, cute! It's sewed on to the red, though. We'll just leave it. Nicol Nicola, Nicola, hello. And that message is for you, Miss Maggie. Hi, Nicola. Okay, we got to have a bowl. Got to have a bowl, but it's got to be a grungy bowl. So I will take my seam binding and cut it in half. Cute little picture. I can do that. You know, I I gotta. I don't know what I did without my Christmas stuff. Oh wait a minute! I got something. Good idea. Oh, she's from Australia, too. Well, welcome. Wow. What you working on, Meg? Oh, another pretty picture. Those are gorgeous. Yeah, the, the pictures are from um, the children's ephemera. Oh, from my porch prints. Yeah, she's she had had some um, like wintry, Christmassy ones all mixed in. All right, we're gonna grungy this up. Put it in the middle. And then. Kendall, you still out there? She was working. Yeah, she on must mitten. be crafting, right? I know. <laughs> Who else is anybody else say they were crafting with us? Let's 
All right, let me go see. I think I got pictures right over here. Get up without destroying everything. Oh, Penny's dying paper. Glennis is crafting. What are you making, Glennis? And Kendall says, yes, I started uh, my stocking first. Oh. oh, thanks, Jenny. All right. Let's see. What else do I have here to use? I just happen to have these that I haven't opened yet. Tim Holtz. Hi, Miss Jamie. Round ornaments. Well, thank you. Jamie loves watching everything we make. Oh, thanks, Jamie. Okay, should I do poinsettias? It's not really grungy. Christmas tree. It'll pick up the green. Oh, that's coming out awesome. I'm having fun. This is like really fun. <laughs> How about a tree and, well, we don't mind a coupon. Let's see. What else do we have? It's okay, Jamie. <laughs> okay. Um, music paper. Oh, just like a little receipt. How about that? It kind of just makes the green all together. How does that look? That is adorable. It is. I might have to go grungy now. See, I, I did know. Like that. I mean, <laughs> your grunge just comes out so good. Well, you know, I think it just makes you feel homey. I don't know. Just, I just want to curl up by a fireplace now. <laughs> right. Okay, that's cute. Um, Jamie, I am, Maggie's working on doilies and decorations, and I just went on the internet and <clears throat> said uh, Google die cut, or um, no, uh, clip art, mittens, a corset, corsets, um, a boot, and the stocking. And I cut them out on whatever, cereal box. This is potato chip box. These are the mittens I made. I just out of all, just recycle things. Yes, Cindy, that's a good idea. Are you talking to me? Tiny stem sack. Yeah. Goodies and um, then this is oh, the yeah. boot. That's a cute idea. A more bling. But it's all just recycled. It's a priority box that somebody sent me, and it was really mangled. This is, um, again, just different styles. And you can, I would, um, I would probably attach these to some gifts on Christmas Eve, depending on who's coming. Used to be 30, but we know that ain't going to happen. So these are just, and then this is what I made tonight. You know, you can really obviously do any shape you can think of, but these are the only ones I could think of. And then the mittens I really like, but I really like this grungy one. So, do I have another grungy? Oh, yes, we do. Okay, so we're going to do another grungy one. So we'll set that aside. I think that's good. We might wax that one. I think the grunge needs a little wax. We'll see. Thank you, Jenny. Oh, a snowman. Oh, All right, we can have a snowman, right? A grungy snowman. Oh my goodness. 
You got to have one of those. There's a snowman in here. Did you see a snowman in here, Renee? I meant to ask Patty, too. Patty, are you crafting? Maggie, Jamie wants to know where you're going to put yours in. A book, a tree. Oh, I don't have... I don't have any, um, any, what do you call it? Any plans to do anything with them. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just making them. You can even hang it from a little pin on the wall or something. I don't see a snowman. How can I not have a snowman? I don't have a tree because the kids have a huge tree upstairs. And I do have a few things that, like, I could put on, you know, I can put on the doors and, and hang here and there. I don't know if I like that. Well, we're just going to have to do something about that. All right, My daughter in law bought me a little tree that's in a pot, though, like, you know, like a plant so that we can plant it outside later. Oh, that's cute. I've seen those big inflatable ones. <laughs> I think the ones with the snow globes are so cute. They look like huge snow globes. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, those are so cute. Hi, okay, Melanie. Got... Hi, Melanie. I'm not had a phone call. Just oh, right. All right, so do we want to go totally, let's see. No, we're not going to go with the green. Let's see. I don't know what I want to do. do. I think there's too much silver now. Hi, Laura. Let's do soft grunge with the lace. Hi, Laura. Right, wait, I'm working on a journal. All right, let's pick out. Okay, let's put that over there. There. Maybe a little pink. Pick out my pictures first. Oh, you know, it's really good at Vienna. Check out a ton of my appliques. Good morning, Gita. 2 a.m. in the morning. <laughs> Hi, Gita. Wow. She's, I think she's in Sweden, right? Sweden, yeah. Yeah, I think she's in Sweden. Yeah. And we'll do a little poinsettia. Oh, I like the Santa better. No, he's too modern. Let's stick with old Santa. Okay. So I got my picture. Hmm. All right. We could always add more if we want. Okay, let's put this on the off. And then we got this nice dirty old not really. Grungy old doily. These are really fun, girls. I encourage you to trace some stuff out. Even with paper. You could do this with paper. It doesn't even have to be fabric and lace. Different papers would be fun. Oh, thanks, Gita. Good morning. 
morning from Western Australia. Sharon, good morning. Wow. Yeah, I think even over there they have different time zones. Australia is so big that I bet it's oh, really? different, I different. I think it might be different times for like Krista and hmm. Sharon. Those would make really good, pretty journal covers too, Megs. Those are pretty. Yeah, it seems like whenever I'm doing something, in the back of my mind, I picture it as like a journal cover. <laughs> and then it makes it a little easier to embellish. Sharon, it's 9.30 a.m. there. Tonight, what time, are you still here, Krista? What time is it there? No, I don't like that either. Okay. 11 o'clock in Bursley. Yes, these though for Sharon, it's 9.30. I mean, 9.03. For uh, Nicola, it's 11 a.m. Hi, Gail. Hi, it's Gail. midday for Jenny in, uh, in Victoria. Allie, it's noontime. Laura received her journal, Lori, and oh my, my, stunning. Thank you so much. Oh, you're welcome. <laughs> In case you hear my husband, he's downstairs talking to my granddaughter. She calls oh, every he? night with a camera phone, and he has to bring her to all the babies <laughs> that Aww. are in the crib downstairs. Aww. And she named it one big baby, small baby, medium baby, uh -huh. new baby. <laughs> <laughs> That's their names. <laughs> big baby, big Okay, so we got that. Oh, we didn't say hi and good night to them. Um, they had they were visiting Santa, so I don't know. Oh, so they might not have been I, home. Yeah, well, they are now. Hi, Joey, if you're watching, and Juliana. Hi, Joey. Hi, Juliana. I'm going to do Santa. Santa, bring the baby back to me. And then we need some. Okay. Do a little piece of card. We'll put Santa on cardboard. Cardboard. I'm making Christmas ornament scale. Let's see, this is the first one. Just quick and easy ones. And then this is the second one. That is so gorgeous. <laughs> I cut out one. I used it's. I used um, it had a stripe and flower background. This here. I think I'm going to put that together in a minute and then see how that looks as a poinsettia. Hi, Lucy. You snuck right in. I didn't even see you. Where? Who's? Oh, Lucy. Lucy. Hi, Lucy. <laughs> I didn't even see her. Of course, I think we've been concentrating. We haven't paid attention. I know you get engrossed in what you're doing, then you forget all that. about the chat. Good morning, Laura. 
Isn't that Gita? Isn't that hey, Laura, absolutely gorgeous? Hey, I think that's the winning ornament of the night. Oh, the poinsettia. Oh my God! Yes. <laughs> yep. It'll be a run on diamond dust. <laughs> This is still grungy, but it's it's got the feeling of more um, Victorian vintage to me. I'm just gonna, I'm just layering, just doing. Yeah, that's pretty. What feels okay. right? Glennis just sent me a photo. Let me see what she's working on. Oh, cool. Oh, those are pretty, Glennis. Do you want me to show them? I'll put that on you if she does. Yeah, I don't want to show unless she says it's okay. Right. <laughs> I think I'm just going to... Well, I guess I could put more of this on here. Okay. So I think... Let's see... I cut it out. And I'm just going to piece this together because I only got a little piece left. So I'm just going to use it. A little piece of doily. Let's go underneath. Okay, that's not going to work. <laughs> she wants you to do the corset. Oh, oh, you know, I didn't even cut that out. I gotta cut yeah, that out. Jamie wants I you will to do, do that. Corset, she said. She said. That would. Alrighty, let me let me just put some pearls. Since this is more of a vintage look. I'll put some pearls right down this lace. Cool. And well, now I want to do the corset. <laughs> Thanks, Jamie. Now I'm like a kid. I want to jump. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Okay. Right, let me. Um, we'll let that one dry. We'll see. Let me get the corsets. Let me do that. I'll do the big one because they're kind of big, but um. I wanted to, you to be able to see it. Oh, the pressure's on. I didn't do one of these ahead of time. And I will get just a piece of... This one I'll just do on old... Just file folder. I keep forgetting that's glass. Hmm? I keep forgetting. I keep knocking, well, putting my scissors down hard and it's on glass. I have glass underneath. And I keep forgetting it's glass. It's not making a lot of noise. And I'm just tracing this. for you to be closer. Okay. Like I said, you could use file folders, cereal boxes, anything you got.
Now I did cut this out double because I want it thicker. All right. So let's see. We got this. I'm going to get my all because I know I want holes. One, two, one. We're only going to do one, two, and I'm not measuring. I'm not. I'm just eyeing it. Well, we'll do no ten. measuring. No. It's a Christmas ornament. I'm not poking my fingers. There. Now, let's see. Oh, bye, Sharon. Thanks for bye, Sharon. hanging out with us. Let me. I think I'm just going to go over this. Cover this in the wedding dress so I can still see the hose. That's what I'll do. Oh, thanks, Joanne. That's another Crafty Me Shop little trim. All right, let me just zip this on the sewing machine. Okay. Oh, uh, Craft TV Shop, Lori, on Facebook. Got the lace, I'll trim around it. And now and this we could really glitz up. All right, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to get my, I got to put the laces in, otherwise we're going to lose it, the, the flare of the, so I'm going to re-poke these. Actually, I'm going to put it all in so I got the wide part of my awl. I can get the seam binding in there to get it. In, hopefully. This will be the hardest part. But I think we can do it. I'm going to go in from behind. This is a little brush to my uh, uh, well, um, so much so much. 
I could have done one. Did anybody ever wear a corset? We did some oh reenactments. Oh, I love them. I mean, they were the fancy ones. They were the play ones type thing. But they do make your waist look small. Just can't breathe for a while. But. Right. <laughs> <laughs> all right. I think that's all I'm going to do for this one. <laughs> trying to keep Keto. it simple. Okay. Your sewing machine sounded like my neighbor's tractor. <laughs> yeah, it's working pretty hard. All right. Let's see how this poinsettia comes out. Ooh, another one. Yeah, I'm gonna try this. Um, the one, the one with the cream and the red, that had a flower background. Mm -hmm. Just shows you, you can use any background Just pieces that. too. It doesn't have to be Christmas. Now, if I was really gonna take my time in this, I'd probably do the eyelets and stuff, but just a Christmas ornament. And you're covering up with lace anyway, so you don't really need to worry about it. Let's see, did I do that right? Let's see, that goes there, and that goes here. Come on. You did hate him? Ooh. <laughs> of course, I love any of that girly girl stuff. Okay. One, two. Your whole ball. Two. Okay, boy, we're really quiet tonight. Oh, I know. <laughs> Last time, Last I, time I wore corset, a corset, we went from, from six to seven kids. I gave the corsets away. <laughs> okay, I think I'm just going to do these two and then just... Have them come out and tie them in the bottom. You get the gist of it. Come on, get in there. And then we'll get my little appliques out. All right, so we got two crosses. Let's see, where are we? Two crosses. You got the lace. Oh, wow, that's so pretty. Thank you. That's beautiful. And then Oops. is there going to be a part two of this video? Um no, right? No, no, I don't think so. No, this will probably be my last thing by the time I get this done. I can't believe Christmas is a week from Friday. We won't be on again together anyways, at least till next Tuesday. So this is probably the last, The well, actually, it's the only Christmas one, right? Do we yeah. do it? 
Yeah, we didn't do any other Christmas. No, we did those little envelopes or the the pink Christmas. We did a couple of them. I don't know what we decorated with. All right, so we got that. And then let's see what appliques did I pull out. Because I need something delicate. This might be too big. Definitely too big. Let me go get some. Pull out some small pink ones. I have pink appliques. Okay, so we need to do um well actually they gotta have some kind of a little ruffle at the bottom. I will use some of this stuff. This is another very, I mean, same wedding dress. Just very, uh, I think it was like the second layer underneath it. And then we're going to turn it over. And I'm going to put my glue. And again, girls, I'm not measuring. I'm not. I'm just going to put it on here. And I'm going to start crunching it up. Just squish, squish, squish. And then I'll cut the excess off and get it on there. Maggie, what is that beautiful glitter you're using? Gita wants to know. <laughs> It is called Diamond Dust by Twinklets. I wonder if they can they even sell that anymore. I don't know. Because, I mean, this is probably 12 years old anyway. It's almost, almost gone. I do have another one, though. <laughs> I never <laughs> opened it yet. So... And it lasts forever. And I won't, I won't cut this. It's a little too long. See, I put it on this one, too. Okay. So I'll just leave it like that. So I think I'm going to concentrate over here. So we have... Oh, yeah, this is the really light... Iridescent. I really like this one. So I'm okay, going to so he's asking there. about um, Crafty Me Shop. So Crafty Me Shop is a Facebook group where Esme, who's the owner, sells laces, trims, vintage. Um, Laces, appliques, um, fabrics, all that kind of thing. And you have to belong to the Facebook group in order to um, buy from her. So you have to ask to join the group. But it's called The Crafty Me Shop. I think there's a the in front of it, isn't there? No, just Crafty Me Shop. No. Nope. Hmm. Wait a, one second and I'll put a link. Yes, Miss Jamie. I I almost really forgot all about it. <laughs> I I'm printed them out and then I forgot to. I mean, this could really be really. I have to make a little. And I should be more careful cutting these out so the beads don't fall off. <laughs> but Maggie's not looking, so. 
I'm not what? I'm not looking. Shh. I know. I'm trying. I'm trying to get get the link of for uh, correctly me shot. Where's my groups? I hate this new format on Facebook. I really do. I can't oh. find anything. They feel the need. They got to change things all the time. Oh, there it is. Okay. It's just crafting. See, I was wrong. It's just crafting me show. Okay. Copy. Oh, thanks, Patty. I just was going to get it. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Kimberly. Walmart sells the chunky crystal glitter. But that's real fine, though, right? What you're using? Yeah, this is. It's not. It's not glitter. It's little. Uh, I think. It, let me read the back of it because it, it's. I don't think it's glitter. Hmm. It's manufactured from finely ground glass. That's what I thought. It had to do with glass. Wow. Yeah. But I mean, it's so fine. I never like cut my fingers on it or anything. Hmm. So, I'm yeah. mixing the blue for the pinks up because we can. Yeah, you don't want it around children or animals, that's for sure. But I've never had a problem with it as far as like, you know, it's so fine that I've never like cut my fingers or anything. Oh my gosh, my throat is so dry. I know I might have to have dry. another candy cane. I'm just... Putting, uh, I'm just having fun making my, my own corset. <laughs> right? All right, I need to find another dangle. I don't know if I really like it that much um, using that the striped and flower paper, but... I think it's okay. It's pretty, but yeah, nothing compares to that first one you did. Hi, Allison. Maggie is making beautiful decorations out of doilies and appliques. I'm making some out of um, clip art. I cut out on cardboard and um, recycled recyclables. Right now I'm making a corset and we made stockings and we made mittens and boots. I only actually made one boot. I'll go with the stocking. Oh, these will go together because I use the same thing. Hmm. Very cute. So I know I'm not keeping up with you, but how many have you done? I did the corset. Well, I'm working on that one. And I did this mitten. But don't forget, though, these are already, the, the material was already on them, so I just had to decorate them. That stocking and that stocking. I do like the grungy. This one's okay. This one needs help. This one's in like a, all right, goes to the bottom of the pile one. But those are cute. He loves the, um, what do you call it? The corset. Yeah, that, that needs some um, more tension. And I mix, I'll mix more tomorrow of how I lace it. I think I need to do them a little further apart so you really see the lace go all the way down. <clears throat> I 
and I got the um found the diamond dust on eBay about fifteen dollars Australian. So it's probably, yeah, it's probably like I don't know, eleven or twelve maybe. I know our ours is um our dollar is worth more. That's what I was trying to say. <laughs> Yeah, I just see a thing <laughs> pop up. The Canadian border is closed to us or U.S. Hasn't that been closed or? Um, are they open? I don't and they know if it, is Louise. Louise, are you still here? Do you know if the border or Glennis or Lucy? They're the Canadians. Yeah, they got it on Amazon. Six dollars on Amazon. Six dollars on Amazon. You know what I need, and I don't have them. I wish I could get some from you. These those hangy things. <laughs> the what? Using right now. <laughs> the seam binding. No, see those little dangly do the. Oh, the dangle. oh, the dangle trims? I don't think I have any. Oh, you know what? Hang on. <laughs> That's what I need. Of course I need them. I thought it was our, always closed except to essential. Oh, maybe it's I been don't know extended. What the was. Paula said dingles. Or she's trying to say dingles. I got some. I got some. See, I get so much from her, I forget what I got. No, I just don't need them this wide. Well, maybe. Yeah, the dangles I used are, are from my stash. They're not from Crafty Me Shop. Oh, yeah. Just some more. Okay. I guess I'm, this is going to be a showgirls corset. Okay, Joanne said I checked. It's eight eighty nine on Amazon. That's not bad. No. Now watch we all run to get it. It'll be gone. Right. <laughs> It'll be sold out. All right, so I'm going to use that red seam binding again. Oh, I did get my spatula. Oh, where is that? No, I can't find that. Come on. I will have to use this. Still closed. Yeah, I notice that sometimes, Paula, depending on who's selling it, the, the prices change. Right. The third party seller, or if it's prime. Okay, this is, doesn't want to stick. Patty, you're allergic to glitter? Oh, my God. Okay. I didn't know that. Okay. 
Okay, now I need little one and the bodice. Let's see. Okay, another quick and easy one. I can't really think of anything else. I don't think it really needs anything else on the point setters. I have to take this off here now. That is what some people say when they don't like something. <laughs> Lucy. Hi, Michelle Rowe. Well, hello, Miss Michelle Rowe, you enabler. I'm, I'm waiting for my light and fluffy um, paste. Oh, you're waiting for it? Yeah, it hasn't come yet. Oh, I thought you had it. Oh, no, no. I got my paper, my Italian paper that Patty was showing the other night. That's gorgeous. Okay, so that is... Uh, listen, Michelle, this is my gesso free corset. Actually, there's no gesso on any of these projects. <laughs> these are mittens. These are all made out of um, recycled boxes. We did mittens. You should put it on corset. you so you can show them everything. Exactly. Lori, put it on mm -hmm. you so they can put oh. it just on you. Okay. Okie doke. Now we can, we'll be able to see it better. <clears throat> okay. Oh dear. Now it's a mess. Hang on. Okay. So we just ended with the corset. And then we did oh, the mittens. Beautiful. Oh, the mittens are so cute. I did. They are my favorite. The mittens. And I was working on this one until Jamie mentioned the corset, and then I stopped working on this one. But these are the green. I love those. I, yeah, I do kind of like the. Yeah, those are so cute. I guess you think of the stockings, and they're old. <laughs> and then the little boot. It kind of goes with the corset because I use the same applique. And then these are I did last night. This is one that's got wax from the other live that we did all the wax on the cardboard. And then this one is I put a little journal in the back of it or a little notepad. And it's more, more of a vintage one with the pink quilt. And then this one like is okay. It has the wedding dress with the blue. It just needs some more help. So, it, like, like I said, that goes to the Is bottom. Is it too light for you? I just not. I don't know. There's just so, something not right. I don't know. I don't know if I don't like the ticket. I don't know. It's just one of those things. Yeah. I don't know. Where this one I love, but it's, you know, loaded with stuff. So, it's probably that. It's more just shabby chic. Okay, yeah. You and this to... one I used um, kind of more vintage with, um, I think that was Dreams Etc. Girl from one of her kits. Yeah, that's cute. But I made a lot well, of these last says, night. To, that white one, she says, Doug, get in coffee. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> beeswax. <laughs> I should gesso it. See, I should have gessoed that. Get that nice sandy grit on it. So that's that. Now we will go over to Miss Maggie. Okay, and you got to catch up on chat because they were saying quite a oh. bit about your stuff. All right, so thank you, ladies. This is, this is the first ornament I made. I just love these. Those are so pretty. A little boy and girl, and I just added some pieces of applique in the corner, and then. Then I went to, I think I went to the pink and white poinsettia, added a dangle to it. And there's, you can see the diamond dust. Now that the um, 
the glue is dry, I think it'll be a little more sparkly. What's that? That is just so pretty. <laughs> and then this one, this is a uh, Crafty Me Shop piece of an applique. The applique is a, <clears throat> excuse me, Crafty Me Shop. The dangles are from my stash. And then I framed the picture with this trim here. Added some red seam binding. And then the last one, I did the poinsettia with the um, the cream and the red stripe. And there's some flower. It was there were flowers in the background, but you can't really you can't really tell. So and it's pretty though. Dangle, especially with the red ribbon. Yeah, I, hmm. I just can't think of like anything else that you can really do to it. You know what I mean? Yeah. I probably should have put another doily behind there because this one's a little more open than the others, but I didn't think of that. Hi, so. Maggie. Who came in? Oh, Melly. Hi, Melly. Oh, Melly Kay and then Maggie. Oh, and another Maggie? Oh, yeah, yeah. there I see Hi, Maggie. Yeah, Melanie, it's a uh, Tim Holtz poinsettia dye. I've had it for a long, long time. Oh, it does remind me of the sugar fruit my nanny had growing up. Yeah, the, the diamond dust. Everything is so pretty. Very, very pretty. Thank you, everyone. Are you there, Mag? Are you frozen? Oh. <laughs> no, I'm here. Did I freeze? Okay. No, you're reading, but I thought you were still. Oh. Yeah, I was reading, so it might have looked like I was frozen. So did everybody notice how clean Maggie's desk was? Mm-hmm. Yeah, but you don't see the rest of the table. Well, apparently I'm not that good at camouflaging mine. <laughs> yeah, luckily the camera doesn't show too, too much. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to work some more on these uh, different sizes. I think an even smaller course that would be cute for the tree or yep. something. Or even a front, right, a front of a journal or something. All right, I'm going to mute for a minute. I need to uh, take a commercial, uh -huh. quick commercial break. All right. Uh. Okay, I'll be right back. Yep. Okay. Put a ringtone in the middle, Maggie. Thank you, Miss Jamie. Good night. Cool. I don't know what we're going to be doing next week if I have to see what um, it was like. If we'll be back before Christmas or not. Um, it's just creeping up on us. But I hope you girls will enjoy tonight. It is very, very messy, Melissa. But that's the best way. You're right. Until I try to get out of my desk and then my paper's all over the floor. Pick it up, but that's okay. Enjoy it. But now these are really, um, and if there's something else, you can post in the Facebook um, page, Sacred Momentos, of something else that you might have printed up. You know, I was trying to think of a hat. I couldn't find a good picture of a hat, but a hat would be fun to decorate, a nice Victorian hat. That would really be pretty. I just couldn't clip art one. Cause I, I wanted it fast. So, but, um, what else do I got coming up? Bye now. Thank you very much. Bye. Um, I think that's it. I don't know what direction I'm going in. I'm almost toward the end of my, all my grungy stuff. I was making these, um, uh, Tina from Chevy Debbie Doodab was doing these um, altered full, Envelope fronts that Gail Justinelli had done a while ago. And so I was uh, 
I'm watching her video this morning. She did it yesterday. And they're just really cute and fun, so I was making up a couple of them. So they're really fun. <clears throat> And what else? It's about that. Start making more cookies this week. <clears throat> That's it. Maybe put these on a couple gifts. That would be cute. Then I might even have to make a grungy corset. A corset and a boot together. On a, on a cover in the smaller. Got to be smaller. These are too big. But they would oh, be you're welcome, Jenny. Good night. You're get you're all pixelated. I am. Yeah, you were. At least it looks like it. Let me see. I was probably I'm showing them YouTube. going through them too fast. Yeah, you're pixelating. Luckily, you were saying good night. I'm pixelating. <laughs> Okay, so I told him I didn't know um, if we come back before Christmas. If we'll see what next week's schedule is. And then yeah, we'll um, next Tuesday. I mean, I could pro probably come on. Um, you can just okay. let me know, even if it's kind of last minute. I do have to do some Christmas shopping though. <laughs> um, Bye, Gita. Good night. Oh, Paula said your voice is robotic too. <clears throat> but well, wow, that's pretty good. Yeah, we we'll made it almost right flowers. here, and if we do, we'll we'll um, yep. share it around. Yeah. Next week, though, if we do, it'll be on my channel. Correct. Yep. All righty, ladies. Well, you guys have a nice yeah. night and a nice week, and we'll see you soon. Yep. Good night, everyone. Bye. I got to get my mouse to work here. One, two.